after all, who wouldn't want, wouldn't want a, a Harry Potter wine and just go poof, done, right? We all want that. But it's going to take patience, it's going to take time, but mostly it's going to take resilience and commitment and standing in a peaceful way, not allowing, again, any manifestation of darkness, even if it's a bulldozer coming at you, that is only a manifestation of darkness. It is the tools that the people who think that that is the way to go. Again, I don't believe that those people, I don't believe the police in those lines get up in the morning and go, can't wait to screw up a bunch of natives. That, that's not, frankly, it's not where they are. They're young men, they're frightened to death, that's their job. That's their job. They're going out and they're doing their job. Most natives know that. So the antidote or the way to do this is to just continue standing in the center, do your prayers, continue to get up again. Part of the suit up, show up and shine is this. Get up in the morning, connection is protection. I'm assuming that most people have some kind of higher power that they can go to even if it's your higher self, because there's a lower self that wants an easier, softer, quick fix. And that's kind of where uh, most people are right now. But that's an illusion and it's not going to happen. So why play with it? Again, I don't want to get off centered. But the higher nature, the higher self is connected with something much higher. And that is universal thought, that's unity and oneness. The Baha'is talk about this all the time, and the Unitarians and the Unity people and the Quakers, and you know, all the oneness people. And what we have to do, basically, I, uh, for me anyway, I can only speak for myself, but what I have observed in, in all the people at Standing Rock is Mother Earth knows that they're, we're all protectors of Mother Earth. They're just demonstrating it. And you know what? You will not get put in a position that you cannot handle. Those people are strong. They can handle it. Highly spiritual people. And what this has produced is this little handful of people said, no, we're not going to have oil in our water. You're not going to go through our grave sites. No more. Enough is enough. They stood up. That was with a tremendous amount of faith and prayers and, and hours and hours of connection and prayers and sweat lodges and whatnot and whatnot. They stood up and they said, no, look what happened. A point of unity, a point of light brought nations from everywhere. I'm still very involved with the Sami people up in North Norway and Sweden. I lived in Europe many years working with the Sami people up in the north of Scandinavia and Russia for that matter. And the great Sami nation showed up, the Aztecians showed up. All corners of the earth produced indigenous people. Black people came, Black Lives Matter showed up. All sorts of people showed up. All these ministers and rabbis and all these people showed up. And they're at that camp. People in the back, in the background like me, were supporting the camp with uh, uh, money and food and goods and things that they need. But they are entrenched and they are going to stay there. And the more there, the more violence there is, the more violence, it is violent, and perceived violence, uh, just just young men full of fear doing their job and and pipeline guys I mean they have a job they were paid to do a job and they're not getting it some of them are they're starting to see and that will flip at some point it'll flip because the more violent they are the more they come at these people you've got a whole na you've got a whole world looking at that now and uh, again Mystery power is not going to allow Mother Earth to die. She, she's strong. She might shake enough to get about 2,000 of us off the planet, maybe more. <laughs> she might shake and get us off the planet. <laughs> she might go, ooh. But uh, if it be the will of Mother Earth and, and great mystery power, then uh, who am I to say it's not my, uh, that's my space. Whatever I'm suiting up, showing up, and shining to do, 
That's what I got to do, and I've got to do it with dignity and grace.